We've just arrived at a train station which takes us to our destination. Nice. We've been travelling now since 10 this morning, well half oh, nine, we left the house oh, and we should arrive there by uh, in about two hours. Yes. So we will join you again when we're on the train. We are now on our train, on our way. Kids. So I'm going to give you a caravan tour. So we are staying at the Robin Hood Caravan Park in Rill and you come in through this door here and here's the toilet to the right and then we have a double bedroom. You'll have to excuse our suitcases because we've not yet unpacked them. And there's a double wardrobe just over there. And then obviously the kitchen. The other way's that. It's got a cooker, a toaster, a kettle, and a microwave and a little fridge. And then there's another double room which has got two single beds in for the girls. The girls have been in here already, as you can see by it being messy. And then obviously the wardrobe. And now we have another double room just here for the boys. And a wardrobe again. And the living area. And nanny. And we've got a fire, a TV, and another doorway to go outside. And this sofa turns into a double bed for Nanny. This mess is all off my children that will be cleaned up. Um, and yeah, so we arrived a little earlier than what we expected. We'd never traveled by train, so we weren't actually sure how long it was going to take. We thought that we would get here for maybe two o'clock and we thought that the check-in was one o'clock and unfortunately it wasn't. Check-in was actually 4 p.m. So we had to wait around for quite a long time. Um, the, we've It's happened at other caravan parks. We've arrived a little bit early and they've said, okay, we'll get your caravan sorted and give you keys. But this one was a little bit different. They made us wait. So we were sitting around with all of our bags and stuff. We couldn't really do much. And then two hours later, mother-in-law's breathing started turning really bad. Um, she's got COPD. So she said she needed the keys a little bit earlier so she could get in the caravan so she could take her nebulizer. And thankfully, they sorted it after about, was it 35 minutes? They got it sorted after 35 minutes and we got in. So that is the tour of our caravan. As you can see, it's pretty basic. It was really cheap. How much did it cost us? £139. Um, there's a few little things, little snags, like scratches and things falling off. But I guess you get what you pay for. But up to now, the caravan park's actually looking pretty good. We are just about to take the kids out for a little walk to the park. So this is the outside of our caravan. And Ebony's here. And Zach's there. And 
dad and Renee are here. Matthew is being a hermit right now, so he's chose to stay in the caravan with Nanny for a little bit. And we're just going to check it out. The best thing about this place, guys, is the beach is right there. Right there. But I'll show you around our caravan park as we're going around, I guess. Look at the play area, guys. It's so nice. <laughs> Just over the road from the beach, so you can see the sea while you're playing. Dad's just popping them over the fence so they don't have to walk right the way around. So we're going to walk around now to them and meet them. Thank you. But it's such a nice little play area. And then, if we go just a little over here, I don't know if you can see it properly on the camera, there is actually a little miniature golf course that the kids can go and play in or family which is also really good and a basketball area so yeah it looks really good Renee's just having a little go at the climbing frame Ebony and Zach you're doing it good girl come on Renee woo brave girl welcome to Zach and today we are on our surprise holiday I'm going to take you down this slide Come on, let's go. Woo! That was I'm just going to show you how close the beach actually is to our campsite. There's our campsite right there. And the beach is just at the bottom of this little walkway. It would have been closer, but there's a little golf course in between. And we are here. Because Matthew's but not with us right now, we want to stay with him. To not go on it today. Careful you don't fall. And come back tomorrow. But how beautiful are these views? We came here for our food now. What's it called? The place. Can't remember what's it called. This place. Yeah, it's a diner where you can get trippies from. Yeah, it is. Like a takeaway diner. Yeah. You need my kids' box, and I'm going to show you what you get inside. I got. Oh God, this is hot. I got. Oh yeah, you get a toy in here. There's dining meat, a drink. Dining meat and chips. It's quite a box, that isn't it?